So today we have Shere Khan from 2016's Jungle Book taking on Blue from Jurassic World. Tiger versus Raptor. Who wins? Let's find out. So, starting off with strength. Well, Blue easily overpowered and mauled people. Fought against the bigger Indoraptor, even shoving him through a bookshelf. Fought against the Scorpius Rexes and Camp Cretaceous, and even hurt the Indominus Rex. Although they were very minor injuries, Rexy was doing most of the damage. Still yet, she did hurt the Indominus. But, Shere Khan was a big, bulky, physical monster. Disney really made him into a beast. He effortlessly mauled people to the point he was known for it in the jungle. He casually launched Akila, a full-grown wolf, off of a cliff. He easily one-shotted wolves, easily overpowered Bagheera two or three times, and even somehow matched and then overpowered Baloo, who was like twice his freaking size. Yeah, Shere Khan's stronger here. He also has a stronger bite, seeing that one bite nearly killed Bagheera. Uh, but what about durability? Well, throughout Jungle Book, Shere Khan never really got hurt. He easily withstood hits from Baloo, Bagheera, entire wolf pack, and even being hit by a stampede of water buffalo. Like he literally just shook it off uh, like they were nothing. The only real time he showed signs of pain was when Mowgli's dad hit him with a torch across the eye, leaving a permanent scar. But still yet, yeah, he was still able to kill him despite the injury to his eye. Blue, on the other hand, was stood being sent flying by the Indominus with enough force to crack concrete and actually got was back up just a few minutes later. She got right back up after being yeeted across the room by the Indoraptor and through a bed. She withstood a car crash in Camp Cretaceous just fine. She ignored a trank and she even survived being shot in the stomach for at least a couple of hours, although she would have died if she didn't have surgery. Uh, it's hard to say he's tougher, because, like, Shere Khan basically completely tanked everything thrown at him, but he never really got hit by something like the Indominus or been shot, like Blue was. I'd say Shere Khan is tougher, but Blue really isn't far behind. She can take a beating. Moving on, Blue is faster. Now, Shere Khan was very fast on his feet. But he wasn't as fast as Bagheera, and even the wolves were able to keep up with him. Blue, however, kept an outpaced speeding cars, motorcycles, and ATVs. She invaded an RPG explosion and a point-blank hazardous explosion. She's just faster. So, both have their physical advantages. Now, let's talk about their fighting experiences. Well, in order to become the leader of her pack of sisters... Blue had to fight and beat Echo, who had challenged her, and she did. And apparently her other two sisters didn't want to try for themselves. She also fought against both Scorpius Rexes, as well as the Indoraptor, and actually killed the Indoraptor with some luck and help from Claire and Owen. She's also the only reason why the Indominus didn't kill Rexy. Also, raptors like her were pack hunters, meaning being stranded with would most likely end in death. So the fact that she survived on Isla Nublar without a pack for three to four years is just incredible and honestly insane. She has great survival skills. <laughs> but Shere Khan was a beast, simply put. Like, he casually killed Akila, bested Bagheera three times, nearly killing him, fought off an entire wolf pack, and even somehow beat Baloo in a straight-up fight. He was bloodthirsty and cruel and rolled over the jungle with an iron fist, so much so that like 90% or more of the animals in the jungle feared him. The only exce exceptions were Aquila, King Louie, and the elephants. Even Ka knew to stay away from him. Now, both of them are very intelligent as well. Like, Shere Khan realized that chasing Mowgli would take time and energy, so he simply killed Akila to lure Mowgli back to him, and this worked. Uh, but Blue was referred to as the second smartest organism on Earth, only behind people, and it was her intelligence 
that the Indominus and the Indoraptor had, and both of them showed to be able to be, uh, strategize and plan out attacks. She also had razor sharp teeth and claws designed for ripping apart flesh, especially that big claw on both of her feet. Uh, but Shere Khan's bite, just like any tiger's, was used to crush bones and to one shot his prey quickly. So, who wins? Well, the first time I did this fight, I said Blue would win simply because she fought against the Indoraptor, which Shere Khan couldn't beat on his best day. And that, that is true. That's a true fact. But let's look at the facts. Blue needs a pack to take down big prey, while tigers can take down bigger prey by themselves because they're solitary and are equipped to do so. Blue is like a wolf. A pack of wolves cannot stop Shere Khan. Basically, Blue isn't equipped in taking down a threat like Shere Khan by herself. While Shere Khan is definitely capable of killing something like Blue by himself. And that's really it. Uh, I love Blue, but she is simply not winning this fight. I was wrong the first time. Shere Khan wins. Like and subscribe if you did enjoy. Leave a comment of what you think and hit the notification bell to be notified of all my future videos and other great stuff. I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.